Every five years, lawmakers settle in to work on the Farm Bill, setting the country's food and agriculture policy. We've got an integrated ag industry in this country. This is the envy of the world. We have farmers, extraordinary farmers and ranchers in this country who take risks every day, uh, you know, both financial and otherwise, you know, to put food on our tables. We could have both of those and we could still have a train wreck if we didn't have sound policy in place that was underpinning all of it and ensuring that growers could keep doing what they do. The Farm Bill covers crop insurance, education, and more for working farmers and ranchers. Right now, policy really is intended to help are those who are doing this full time, you know, who are responsible for the, keeping the pipeline full, you know, grocery shel shelves stocked. Bart Fisher and the Texas A&M Agricultural and Food Policy Center help Congress understand that work. The thing we are known for uh, is evaluating the farm level impacts uh, of agricultural policy. Because the risk faced by ordinary farmers is real. In what other industry uh, do, you, do you receive your income at one point, you know, potentially one day or one week, right? During harvest, it all comes at once. But aid for farmers makes up just a small part of the farm bill. Most of it makes sure low-income families have access to healthy food. We've arrived at the point now where it is 83%, you know, in SNAP, you know, the, the, the old food stamp program. Balancing those two issues has led to gridlock in Washington perfect example that's coming home to roost right now on the farm bill is what is the what is the appropriate mix right between support to growers and support to you know Americans who can't afford uh, you know can't afford the meal you know to buy a meal to put on their plate still Fisher is optimistic Congress will work to find a deal that values farmers and consumers we have the most abundant safest and most affordable food supply on the planet because of policies we've had in place and because of risk taking on the part of farmers and ranchers across this country. That's a look at Central Texas agriculture from the ground up. From the ground up is sponsored by Producers Cooperative, proudly serving agriculture since 1943.